I was like, interesting choice. Off no one likes yellow, yellow anyways. Fair. Cloud and Meta Knight. Interesting right here. When provoked, Zenyu is very patient. Oh, without a doubt. Yeah, and Jason will make him very patient. Yeah, and that's a... Uh, Mario actually kind of struggles in the Meta Knight matchup just because, I mean, that F Smash, what are you going to do about it? What can you do? Speaking of which, this down tilts are going to come out, though. Already. I understand the choice to go to, to Town and City, right? But the entire game of Cloud is, you know, back air. We love back air. It's going to keep going, and it's going to kill you earlier because of the side blast zones being so small. You take Meta Knight to Town and City, he will kill you with everything in his kit off the sides. Oh, what a jab lock right here. Not going to get a smash attack off of it, though. This could be this it. Is dead. This is dead. There's no way he makes this back, right? Oh my gosh. Great timing right there from mm. Denny. Just going for it early. Jason Opson opting for the, the mix. He went for that side beat that gimps really easily. Yeah. Oh, we see another offstage situation limit on deck here. Yeah, anytime we see Cloud offstage, it could just be over. Meta Knight is one of the best edge guarders, <laughs> but he made it his show. <laughs> Your edge guard? That was Zenyu's episode right there. He was like, nah, I got this. That was a stolen stock right there. There wasn't much. That was supposed to be Jason just getting an edge guard. That was the inner Mario in him. Yeah. Mario players do that. Just throwing out the forward air. I'm definitely that type of Mario, so I get it. Oh my god. Maybe that's why he mains Cloud. Just a better mark. <laughs> really is. Back air is better, disjointed. <laughs> you have a better fireball. <laughs> but this, these stocks are pretty volatile. Ooh, this is dangerous territory right here. Almost lost a jump. Has it back though, that platform coming in safely. Ooh, okay. Not opting to do the downward hit of uh, Climb Hazard. Yeah, I think if you land on that platform, that was very uncertain death with uh, Meta Knight being able to get these up air. Speaking of which. It wasn't going to be true there, so yeah, he was looking for a little bit of a read. Not able to finish it out though. That was a good uh, back air from Zenyu to just kind of get off me to him real quick. Oof. Hey, we went from one small round character that throws out smash attacks in neutral to another small round character that throws out smash attacks in neutral. Both originally from 2D games, so. Mm. Let's see if the uh, the seniority of Meta Knight can take out cloud in this one. Oh my god, that backer hit? Yeah, I thought he was in front. Ooh, wow, good recovery. Not Dang. that matter though. He beat out the re-grab with neutral B. I didn't think he'd catch him that low. Every option. Every option was covered. At that point, it's like yeah. Jason already knew. I think the only thing that you realistically could have done was just another aggressive up B for no reason. But why would you press that button? Who presses that button there? It's a good button. It is. 140%, I mean, a good back air or an F, so we'll do it. There we go, that good back air that I was mentioning. We're seeing uh, Jason's good use of uh, roll in. Like, a lot of times when we see a lot of these characters, this could be it. Oh my gosh. Oh. Drop that good DI from Zenyu right there. Missing the punish, though, this can cost him. Chose oh. for a dash attack, but Zenyu, good DI, mitigating the combo damage. Yeah, that grab can be deadly, and Zenyu just said, no, get me out of here. I don't want any of it. I'm really surprised we didn't see a down air from Zenyu right there. I feel like he's the type of player who's like, yeah, I'm going to go for this. I'll be safe making it to the ledge. Oh, my gosh, Jason looking for that. It really could be Jason's game this entire time, but Limit is on deck. It could be over. Yeah. Oh, no jump here, Limit. He can Limit. make this back. No, he cannot make it back. I think not. It was not his episode. Nope. Oh, my gosh. It was written. Back air is better. Yo, I was talking to Jason, like, I think it was last week, but he was just, like, praising back air. Meta Knight back air. Oh, it does so much. He's like, Meta Knight back air just kills you at unbelievable sense. And being zero suit, I, I it's over. Yeah. <laughs> it's sad. <laughs> does that eat through the down beat? Um, if he catches it, yeah. But usually he gets me before then. Oh my gosh, yeah, so yeah. you don't get to even Because he's there. That's true. Yeah. 
we're seeing the switch to Mario. Mm. Interesting choice. I feel like that was a pretty close game to confidently be like, no, I need to switch to Mario now. Yeah, I think Zenyu is really good at every character he plays, but oh, when that, it comes yeah. to like being kind of matchup checked, because I feel like Meta does that a lot. Even though he, like, I know Zenyu knows his matchup, but still, like, it's more difficult matchup, so go with the character that you know the best. Oh, without a doubt. It's always the safe bet. We're gonna see explosive plays from both players here now. Zenyu already coming off with 78% off of a couple interactions. If Mario can keep him above like this, down air is no slouch. Yeah. Fireball in air, fireball? Optimal. <laughs> Very optimal stuff right here. <laughs> At that ledge, just fireball and run away. Especially from, honestly, for Meta Knight, you don't want to be too much like going out there for him because real quick you'd be like, oh, I'm the one getting edge guarded now. Yeah. Meta Knight could easily put all this damage back, but able to sneak in the back here doesn't real quick. Meta Knight being the same weight as your suit, you'll die really early. Good combo starter right here. Gonna miss that back air. Was reading the hard DIN. Ooh, oh, into the. Wonderful sword. Get off me. <laughs> Looking to use these fireballs. Kind of break up neutral, get an opening, but... Yeah, we do time. not want that knight to land that dash attack. Oh my gosh, not able to find it. Down there, not going to kill here. Town and City having that raised ceiling. Oh, this will not kill. Good air dodge right there. I'm actually surprised I didn't hit. That looked like it would confirm. Town City being way too forgiving, and then the yeah. side blast zone coming in handy for that all too familiar um, Meta Knight back here. Without a doubt, 140%. I mean, this is a comfortable lead for Zenyu right here. Just kind of sit back, find an opening, get a straight down air, get a up smash forced in there. I feel like both of these characters have, you know, similar play styles. I mean, the, one kills off the top, and, and one kills off every blast zone, so. Speaking of every blast zone, that side one coming in less than 50% taken. He's just gone. Oh, I know the feeling. But Zenyu being as seasoned as he is, that doesn't really phase him. The stock's at 155. He could easily take this and make this easier. Yeah, for sure. I mean, 155 is crazy. I mean, back throw will not take it here, though. Oh, it will. Side, side blast zone. zone. Side blast zone. Come in My handy. bad. We love those side blast zones. I love them. Oh, these down tilts at the ledge. Not going to trip and connect with a jab, though. Oh, Ooh, good combo down. starter. Oh, he just yeah. waited. He knew that wouldn't be true. Usually that prompts him to wait. Yeah. But Zenyu is being pretty patient here. We haven't seen those panic air dodges out of like most most players with panic air dodge. And then what what Jason is looking for there is he's looking for the up tilt. He wants a late hit of up tilt so he can combo up air better. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Zenyu's recognized that because he's kind of seen these options he's finishing for and just kind of sits back. Back throw might kill here. It should. Yeah. On to game three. That ledge uh, in the blast zone being so close. A matchup that could be pretty difficult for Mario is letting Zenyu take the win here because, you know, comfort picks usually like, give an example, I, I don't like Wolf, but I will go Zero Suit no matter what. Like most of the time I've gone Zero Suit because I'm just like, this is the character that I'm comfortable with. Yeah, that comfort pick will come in clutch sometimes, just that ability to breathe back, not have to really put too much thought into this different character. Sometimes it's a difference. I mean, Zenyu's also done this matchup countless times for him to just kind of be like, you know what, let me just lean back on the Mario for now. And I mean, we saw it came out full display kind of convincingly. Just Even a matter it was last stock. It was last stock, yes. And I think Jason didn't get enough of uh, Zenyu just being stuck at the ledge. I feel like we might see it this game, but Zenyu's doing a great job landing, so hasn't been a concern for him. I agree. Yeah, most of it has just been like back and forth, you know, poking, prodding, finding out who can get the first hit. He wants that dash attack, he wants that drag down back air, and Mario wants that grab, you know? That was a mash tap. There was no, no read there. That was not a read on the roll. <laughs> Oh, this is dangerous territory right here. This should be a oh no good DI from Jason. Out. Just straight down and to the right. Interesting. That fireball is gonna put him in a horrible spot now. 50% at this ledge. 
Ooh, good up. He out of shield right there. Going to challenge that neutral air landing. Playing a little bit of footsies. Again, he's just looking for that first hit. We have uh, Jason off the stage. But Mario or, you know, Zenyu is not able to keep him at the ledge. Neither one seems to have a nail down on either This is one, a though. dead Mario right here. Yep. Oh, Ooh. wow. Able to make it back. No uh, chance from Jason. I think he thought he was dead, too. Yeah. That bagger going to seal it. No up coming out. Zenyu was ready for that up Immediately air dodge. I think uh, Zenyu's respecting it, and Jason knows not to use it. Uh, Town and City doesn't really opt to like give up B like, the best kill in, like, option. Yeah, you won't find those early cheap yeah. kills as often. Which is why he's been opting to kill off the side, mostly. No forward air there. Just kind of stopping to sit back. Ooh, There's that forward air. Kind of waited for it. <laughs> Nothing started off that down there. Putting Jason back off stage. Let's see how you can close this out. Not able to find the up smash though. We see this each time. Uh, Zenyu is picking like the best options. That's not gonna kill here, but Zenyu is picking the best options off ledge. He hasn't done the same thing twice in a row. Oh yeah, and it's kept Jason on his toes and just kind of scared to commit to anything, but that back air will let him seal the stock. Even it out just a tad bit. I mean, we saw already that it can get evened out. I know he's at 120%, then you had zero, but mm. Jason, not a stranger to taking these stocks from zero. No, not at all. And Meta Knight being so well equipped, um, we'll see if he can find an opening. But Zenyu's using the pressure of being at, um, at, at Jason being oh, at 135 wow. to f make him forced to come in and take the stock. Yeah, that great up smash out of shield right there. Able to punch the dash attack. But Jason responding, not getting the second hit of the up B. That's going to cost him quite a bit. I mean, now he has to fight all over again, but that fight is going to be over quick, it looks like. Ooh, great. It begs the question, would that even have killed? I mean, they were both off the screen at that point. I'm pretty sure that would have killed. I'd hope. I'd hope for Jason's <laughs> sake, because, I mean, otherwise I'd feel cheated. Oh, Zenyu is not letting Jason find his footing. Yeah. No matter what. Yep. Oh, the frame trap. Yep. You know, I didn't even know that was a It's now very reminiscent of the thing that happened with us in our game. Now very I gotta, reminiscent. I got to be worried about the... I'm going to be thinking about that at night. If you don't do a directional air dodge, it's just a guaranteed forward smash. Or forward air. If you do a directional air dodge, it's a matter of the Mario reading where you're going. It's disgusting. It's too wild. Mario has the strengths. I can't lie. Are they a bit bold? Yes. <laughs> do I still lose? Yes. <laughs> we are on to game four. We're already in a best of five um, you know, yeah. area. So we have time to adapt. And Jason, he can adapt well. It's just that we want to see, like, we have also Zenyu who's great at adapting. And if you're constantly trying to play catch up, the person who's in the lead usually can take it. Without a doubt, great air dodge right there to land, but not able to get any extension off of it. Oh, we see these combos coming out. Not gonna have these platforms anymore. Uh, Jason making the smart choice, taking them at wow. FD. No platforms to stand on. I mean, mm -hmm. that's exactly what he'd want. I feel Zenyu like. turned one whiff punish into 112%. Oh, yeah. This was all off of a down throw, off a of whiff down tilt. Ooh, there's that weak up tilt. I believe that was a strong hit. He couldn't do anything off that. Unfortunately. But, oh, calls up the neutral getup? Oh, 70%. That was 70%. That move's insane. But you gotta give credit where it's due. That that move is active for one frame. Yeah, without a doubt. I mean, he, he definitely earned that. It wasn't just a random, let me toss this out. He was just sick of uh, Zenyu just putting out all these different options. Like, you know what? I'm gonna end it here Oof. and now. Able to get the air dodge out of that. Only 26% taken. Uh, I'll call that a W. Oh, especially with an up smash coming in and sealing it? Yeah. Even two stocks to two. You know, I think Jason really wanted to opt for this uh, flat stage so that Zenyu didn't have anywhere to um, retreat to when it came out to getting off the ledge. We saw Zenyu choosing, you know, Meta Knight is not the fastest, he doesn't have the highest jump height. So when Mario jumps off the ledge and double jumps, 
He can force Meta Knight to overextend and then get back to stage for free, basically. Oh, this should be death. Oh! Yeah. Dang. Optimal. Zenyu having to uh, take a second just kind of scratch his eye like, man, I just really got that. He scratched his eye because he put him to sleep, you know? Yeah. <laughs> Really unfortunate for Jason. I mean, that's why he's been afraid to go for those high upbeats. If he misses it, that's how it can end. And we do notice that, like, Mario doesn't have, like, the most... He has a very, very linear recovery. But given that his upbeat is, like, so active and it can go through a lot of moves, Jason's not able to get much when he goes off stage after him. But that's where, you know, Meta Knight makes the money. Oh, without a doubt. I mean, there has... Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> I saw the vision and my heart skipped the beat. Zenyu wants to kill. Oh, Smash is going to take it right here. He does not want to Smash. He Good. just said, I'm a breakdance on this man. Oh my gosh. No dome needed. Just going to lay out the cardboard on the floor and bust a move. Oh my gosh. Yeah. I, it would have been over either way. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Oh, Smash. Anything was taken and he chose to breakdance on him real quick. Yeah, that was my funny move. You know, funny thing, I'm pretty sure that...